didactics. Yes. So, okay, let's make this quick. Okay, what do you have to show me? What do you have to... What are you going to show me? Okay, once again. I sent you the document about the validation of my instruments sent by teacher. Uh, so I have some questions about. Okay. In the. Johnny, I cannot hear you. What? I cannot hear you. You were saying something? Were you saying anything? Yes, I sent you the document about the validation. Okay. The answer, right? Uh, uh, no. Okay. The validation sent the feedback sent by teacher mapper. Ah, okay, that's it. So I have a question in the observations part. Okay, let me go there. Let me come here. Okay, observation. Yes, but, did but you I, receive but I don't my have the, email? No, I don't have the, the what? The, ah, you send me that via email or via the assignment? Via email. Okay, so let me check the email. Okay, here, yes. So, like 20 minutes ago. Let me open to it. After checking the instruments, I have some comments. Ah, okay, cool. Okay, let's see, Johnny. Let me open it. I think I'm going to to what to um, share my screen. Yes, uh, to see the that part. Okay. Slow connection? Yeah, kind of slow connection. Okay, here I do have uh, like. Ah, I comments. already did the correction. Okay, cool. Uh, so I here. Did the correction. One three are very similar. The also, there are, many, there are many questions for a semi structure interview. Okay, porque soy les. ¿Qué tipo de.? Okay. Number two. This says nothing about the category of the questions. Here you must decide what, what aspects of topic you want to find out or discover by applying the instrument. Oh, okay. This is to help you to organize the data when you uh, are in the analysis stage. Got it. Okay, cool. ¿Por qué es importante un buen entorno en la clase? Yes, I do agree. Okay. So here, 
Observations don't have questions, rather they have more items or criteria to observe. Decide what aspects, uh, which uh, those aspects, but take into account according to the question, some of the aspects are going to be impossible to observe. Uh, okay, got it. Mm, yeah, so yeah, so let's not use questions inside the, the observations, but instead we're going to use just statements, right? Or criteria to observe. So for example, so let's say here this part would be those statements. Yeah, so it's something like a what aspects of the virtual no, so some like a aspects of the virtual environment. Uh, no, sorry, the as the most important aspects of the virtual uh, learning environment towards students learning motivation right so in that way it's going to be kind of general but it's going to be uh it's going to have a kind of guidance for us to to what to take into account here for example uh what all to the factors so here the intrinsic factors such as the role of extrinsic factors such as uh, teachers, classmates, the platform, uh, online material, blah, 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 play at the motivating or demotivating students when learning the language via online. Okay, so sounds good. And then a sub items of like uh, reactions in relationship to the factors noticed by the students or the participants. So, in that way, we're going to use uh, these ideas. And uh, we're not going to ask questions, but we're going to uh, just give the criteria to be observed. And that's it. Got it. Okay, anything else? Uh, let's go back to the first part in the interviews. The interviews. Ouch. Okay, ah, I here. already, I already, already did the corrections about the number of the questions in okay. interviews. Uh, I already. How did many that. questions? And nine. Nine questions. I decided to, yes, because she told me that there were a lot of questions for an interview. Okay. And I. I decided to erase the question that she marked a uh, regular and okay. I left the excellent questions. Okay. And but the question but the question here is that she said something about the category. Okay. Yeah, so the category that, is going to tell you not, as I assume here. This this says nothing about the category of the questions. Here you must decide what aspect, topic or of topic you want to find out or to observe by applying the instrument. This is to help you to organize the data when you are in the analysis stage. Got it. So for example, here you're going to put you're going to add, um, let's say category. So this question, for example, desde punto de vista, por qué es importante estudiar hoy en día inglés. So by this, you're going to take into account that this question sounds personal, right? So categories, so for example, um, personal question related to uh, interests on having chosen the the what the, the degree, right? So for example, son las notas académicas importantes para usted, son like a point of view related to uh, quantitative uh, quantitative uh, what? marks versus the the what um, versus the i forgot oh yeah so quantitative mark versus the quality of learning or the learning quality something like that right so what you want to get inside the category right so what you want to to get the objective of each question right what do you want to get with that question? Okay. Okay. That is what I should write there. Yes. Okay, that's the question I had for that part. Okay. Okay, anything else? Okay.
not uh, puzzled, so okay. I'm going to do decorations to send it to send it to her. Okay, sounds good. Okay, so um, yeah. oh, that's all. Catch you up later. Keep on working. See you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Thank you. See you later. Bye bye.